right, so we're gonna make a quick and simple charcuterie board. I've got a bunch of different ingredients here. I always keep these on hand for snacks. So I've got um, here a charcuterie board assortment of meats. They're sweet and spicy varieties. Um, I've got copa, sausage, and soppressata. Um, but you can use whatever cold cuts you like to use. Um, here's a bunch of olives and marinated mushrooms, um, peppers. I've got a bunch of different kind of cheeses. Um, Gruyere, I've got some goat cheese, I've got some Gouda, some uh, Havarti, Jarlsberg, and cheddar. Um, again, use whatever cheese you like to use. I like to use a bunch of different varieties. I've got some for something sweet, I've got some berries, I've got some bacon jam, I've got some honey. Uh, I'm gluten free, so I've got some gluten free crackers. You can also use toast. Um, that Melba toast, you can use bagel bites, um, any, any little heart thing, vessel to carry your meats and cheeses on. I've got some ramekins to put some of the things in, and I've got a beautiful uh, board. This one is bamboo, and you can get them inexpensively anywhere. Um, so we're just going to put this together. Okay, so I've put some of the ingredients in the ramekins. I've got some marinated mushrooms here. I've got a, an assortment of olives over there. I've got my bacon jam. I've got, I just took a little shot glass and filled it with honey. Um, I still have a ramekin left, which I will see what I'm gonna use. And this, you don't have to put it this way. You can put it any, any way you want. And you're just gonna arrange everything else around it. Um, I'm just starting this way and then we'll see as we go. So next I'm going to put down the meats and cheeses. sticking it in whatever empty corner there was. Um, I ended up putting my berries in one of the ramekins. Um, I had some apricots also, so I added those to the plate here and there. Um, I put my crackers in a bowl on the side to be nice and easy to get to. And that's it. Just get yourself some tongs. Um, even just wooden toothpicks will work. And so your guests can help themselves. I invite you to have fun with us and try it. Um, it is a beautiful presentation. Um, very nice for when you have your guests coming over and they have something to snack on until the main meal. Um, or even just um, Christmas morning when you just don't want to cook. <laughs> you just want to have a little snack. Um, so I invite you to try this and uh, have fun.